Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone is doing fantastic. Okay y'all, I have this beautiful bag here. At least I think it's beautiful. I love pastel colors. I love this tie dye effect. It is so cute. Now, if you remember for my birthday, I had received an Amy Kestenberg leather bag, the Tamitha, and um, I had to sadly send that back. I was, oh, I hated sending it back, but the zippers were terrible. It would not open hardly, and even trying to zip it back to close it up, it was such a struggle. And I know um, I love her brand, but I had also, a few years back, had to send one back to QVC. It was an Amy Kestenberg I had gotten from QVC and had to send it back for the same um, reason. It was the zippers. Um, they're just really sticky. They're not smooth. But once in a while, you know, I can get a bag like this one's not too bad. This one is very nice. It sticks a little bit here and there, as you can see. But it's nothing like the other one was. But this bag is super nice. This is the Lighten Up Tote by Amy Kestenberg. Really, really love this. I bought this separately. Plus, I have, I believe it's the wallet in there. Well, I didn't <laughs> initially, I mean, I did not purchase this at the beginning. Um, this was a birthday gift. This, the wallet, and the other bag. But what I did, I kept the accessories that uh, was purchased with that bag for this bag. Because no matter what, I still wanted this print. So, this is leather, but this is like nylon. But that's the story of the bag. And I wanted to show you all a little bit about this. This is a zip-around compartment here with really nice um, leather zipper pulls. Little fringy tassels. Or, yeah, they're really cute. And on this bag, you have um, some long straps that fit perfect over the shoulder. Nice shoulder strap drop. And you have some leather handles, which is a nice touch. And if you wear this uh, with this, these handles tuck in the bag. Now, on the back of the bag, now this bag can get slouchy. It is filled up pretty well right now, but you can still see it's a little slouchy. And it gets slouchier as I'll unpack it, but pretty much stands up, you know, on its own. This is the back pocket. I keep my phone in there, which I'm recording with right now. And my phone is a iPhone 11 Pro Max. So it's the large one and it fits perfect. This is a large, this will fit any size phone. This is a very large pocket in the back. And it has the hidden magnetic. Now, speaking of hidden magnetic, if you go to purchase this bag, now on the website, I have had a heck of a time. Like I said, the first Amy Kestenberg I had to send back the leather one because of the zipper. Okay, from her site, um, I got on there to, you know, because I sent that one back, and to pick out one, another one. So... I had picked out this one because I'm like, okay, I love this because if the zippers were sticky on that one, it'll probably be sticky on another, you know, if I was to get the same bag. So I decided to go with this, but on her site, this part is hidden magnetic. It's not snap. So if you look at the pictures on there, you'll see a hidden magnetic um, closure, but it comes snap. Okay, now this is what happened. I ordered this bag. It came in. And I noticed it didn't have the head magnetic snap. It had a regular snap. And then it was filled with dog hair. There was dog hair, like dark dog hair all over it. It had a stain on the side. It was just, it was definitely, definitely used. Disgustingly used because it was not kept up at all. It was really nasty. I can't even believe that was sent out. So I had to send that back. And this time just got a full refund. So this one I found, that one was 200 something dollars off the Amy Kestenberg site. I found this one at Nordstrom's Rack for $99, which was a major, major good deal. <laughs> I mean, that's a lot of money off. It was like $130 off, somewhere around there. 
And um, I think the sale is still going. But if you get this from Amy Kestenberg, you're going to pay over $200. Nordstrom's Rack has it for $99. Now, Nordstrom's Rack, same bag. You know, ordered the same one from them. And it came brand new, which was nice. Nice and wrapped up. And it still has the snaps. Um, like this, the metal snaps. They are magnetic. I wish it was a little bit stronger, but it's not bad. It does stay. And I got it packed full, so it does stay. But um, anyway, I preferred the hidden because I just love the hidden magnetics. And so anyway, I don't know why that picture isn't. It's even on QVC. If you get this back from QVC, it shows a hidden magnetic snap. Um, Nordstrom's did not. It showed the metal and the Amy Kestenberg site shows the hidden. Okay, I'm sorry this is so long-winded, but I wanted to explain this whole ordeal with this bag. <laughs> with the first one, the leather one, and then this, it's just been one heck of a time trying to get one of these bags. So, I'm happy with this. I love it. It is not going back unless something, of course, was to break on it or tear or whatever, but it is nice, and it's a keeper. I love it. Okay, y'all. Now that we got all that out the way, sorry, it is taking so much time. Um, this is an accessory I have, and here I've hooked this on, and this is the Chapstick Cotton Candy. Okay, this is the front uh, zipper compartment, which is huge. You have this big, big area, and you have, like, um, an area here in the middle, here and here and this thing is like just really packed full today and here i have another accessory that was purchased with this which this is the um i haven't used this yet but it's the mask it's really quilted nice it has some filters with it so this and it came with this cute pouch really cute i have my uh sanitizing spray a lot of the stuff i put in this front so it's easy access my screen wipe, a mirror, my uh, other mask, a fan, my lotion, medication. Make sure it's off right there. Right here, I have some um, tissue. I have a lip uh, exfoliator. Love this stuff. I love this too. This gives a beautiful tint of color on your lips. Um, cover girl oat sugar, it's in jelly. Let's see, yeah, jelly number nine. Cannot get that to focus. And bubble gum, antibacterial hand sanitizer. And y'all, this smells just like bubble gum. I love this stuff. Here we have a lens wipe, we have some more hand sanitizer. And some overnight glasses. This came from where I get my eyeglasses from. Um, you can order these overnight, the eyeglasses, or, you know, just do regular time. Of course, it's a lot more expensive if you want to overnight them. But it works well for people that need their glasses, you know, if they broke them and that's the only pair they had. But um, I do buy my glasses from this company, and they always send one of these um, with my glasses. It. And I just love these colors. Let's see. Okay. Now, falling over. All right, y'all. Now, this bag, what I'll do, I'll show you the inside of it once it's unpacked kind of hard to see all the little pockets or whatever with it packed up okay here is a wallet i had gotten with the first purse which this one's leather y'all this leather is so nice i love it i have my change in the back but in this wallet just beautiful i'd like to use this with a lot of my other bags that are you know in the pastel colors and you have a slip here cards there Another compartment here, a zip pocket there, money pocket here, or whatever you'd like to put, pocket here, 
one here and more card slots. And let me see, this has, I thought, um, okay. I thought it had some tags in there. Maybe they're in the other pocket. I have my prayer beads in here. I have a cute little notebook, little notepad to write on. I always carry, try to at least, carry paper with me. I have this little, um, this is by Kenzie. I have this little pouch, it feels quilted, like padded, I mean. And this is, um, this has feminine products in it. Little wristlet pouch. And I have this uh, wristlet pouch also. This one came out of my other bag, if you remember the one that had, it's all, the outside of it's like this that I received, or I'd gotten off of um, Amazon for like $12.99. I have my little lip smacker, love that one. I have the Covered Girl, I don't know why it's not focusing, there it is, Clean Fresh Cooling Glow Stick. Some papery lavender oil. Y'all, this is a lot of my same stuff. Um, bare mineral serum. My file buffer. Uh, some breath spray. Tied to go. A zollipop. Makeup wipe. Some roll aids. I um, mix inhaler stick, some cotton nail wipes, and some sugar-free linen cough drops. And this is the little perfume I've been carrying, the pretty and purple Juicy Couture. It's a little miniature, it's so cute. And this is what I'm talking about, this bag. Once it start, you start to unpack it, it will fall on its face. Love this bag, y'all. I know I've said a lot of negative to it. <laughs> I do love it. Um, a cute little pen I thought looked pretty with this bag. And here's the hand sanitizer gel that's in here. It's in this little unicorn furry thing. It's so cute. Look up to for that pocket. And this is the one, this, this pouch I have just, me and my husband's um, vaccination uh, cards where we got vaccinated and um, it has like some wipes and stuff in there, just like a little kit. I have this little alarm thing, you can push this to make a loud noise. And this is the post office box key and my thing to open doors with. I have this little Kipling pouch in here. Um, I love this little pouch. I got this in here to put my jewelry in. Like I said, like times, like I've told y'all before, most of the times when I get out and about, by the end of the day, I'm already taking off my necklace or a ring or something or earrings or whatever. <laughs> I never last all day with them. And I put them in something in my purse. I have a back scratcher. I have some Olay serum and cactus water, cooling cactus water. I have my pepper spray. And I have some gum here. This is a double fresh cotton candy, sugar free, which is running low. I love this stuff. Okay. Let me see what we have in here. Oh, we have my Atkins bar. This is this is one of my favorite ones. The peanut butter. I have my purse holder. Well. Okay, this is the Kenzie um a pouch. 
think this was purchased at Burke's Outlet, I believe. It's this pouch. And here are some of the tags. Let's see what this one is. Lighten up nylon spiral tie dye. Yeah, this is the bag. Like I said, that is the original price. If you get it from Nordstrom's Rack, it is $99. $99.99 or something like that. Much better price. But QVC and Amy Kestenberg and all those sites, as of the last time I checked, they were all still over $200. Let's see if I have any. This is the wallet. Zip it up, front zip wallet, spiral tie dye. Now, I haven't checked out the accessories on other sites because I never did send those back. Like I said, I kept the accessories with my first. And this is Timothy, Timothy Key Fob Spiral Tie Dye. That's a little key fob on the front. Okay, y'all. Now, let me tuck this pocket back in. But you can see it's very slouchy, but one good thing about this, if you're on a trip, and you go to change bags or anything, this will fold up nicely and it's lightweight, but it is thick and durable. Oh, I see something else down in there. We have a, uh, a Vera Bradley measuring tape and a hair scrunchie. Okay, you have, if you see, two large pockets on the side. Those are for a water bottle. Now these do not have a bottom. You can see my hand goes all the way through. It's just to hold maybe an umbrella or a water bottle, but I do wish they had a bottom where this could be used as another pocket if you decided to use it for something and it wouldn't have to worry about it falling through. I think they should at least put a, po a bottom on one of these pockets, but that's okay because I've already used it for a water bottle, which worked very well, an umbrella, as you can see there. And then you have two slip pockets here and you have your back zip pocket and of course your uh, large pocket in the back which is perfect for a phone but I'm sorry I'm having such a hard time it's there it goes it's a slouchy bag but it, it, like I said it does well when it's full but isn't it pretty I love this color Love it, love it. And I'm sorry this video is so long. I had to tell y'all the story about the bag. So that took a while at the beginning. But I'm going to let y'all go. And I hope everyone is doing great. And hugs to you all. And hope to see you on my next. Bye-bye.